my wife Anna and I run Ivy Creek Family Farm and uh, we're in, located in Barnardsville, North Carolina, uh, about 15 minutes north of Weaverville and we grow every variety of produce that we can figure out how to grow here in the mountains from potatoes to peas to sweet potatoes to lettuce uh, to shiitake mushrooms and cut flowers strawberries, asparagus, you name it, we try to grow it. Um, and we try to grow it because people always ask us for it. Uh, our products are available um, at tailgate markets and through our CSA. Um, the CSA is a community supported agriculture and the way that works is people buy a share of the farm before the season starts uh, and then they get a distribution from the farm for a set amount of weeks. Ours is 22 weeks so people pay for their produce in the beginning of the season and then we deliver it over a 22 week period. It's great for us because it helps give us money to purchase seeds and stuff in the beginning of the season. Um, and it's great for people because they know that they're going to get top quality produce um, and uh, they know they might ha have to get to market right away to get that broccoli or something that might sell out. Uh, we sell at a Wednesday market in Weaverville. Uh, it's on Wednesday afternoons. It's from 2.30 to 6.30. And uh, that's just above Lake Louise at the community center there. Um, it's about 20 to 25 vendors there, given the time of year. And everything that you can buy under the sun is there. Uh, even have homemade ice cream there every once in a while. Um, that's not our product, but it's a fun one to mention. Um, we also sell at the North Asheville tailgate market which is on Saturday mornings um, on the campus of UNCA that's from 8 to 12 that market's 31 years old that's the oldest market in uh, western North Carolina and both of those markets that we sell at are producer only markets and what that means is uh, if you're buying something there the person you're buying it from raised it, made it, grew it, baked it, whatever the product may be, they made it. Um, and uh, that means your dollar is going directly to the person who is trying to make a living, uh, doing doing something that they love. Um, we have uh, garlic growing in the fields right now, and our spinach is up. Our carrots are just poking through, and we have uh, oh, plenty of strawberries out, and you can see. Uh, in here in the greenhouse we have a whole bunch of stuff that's about ready to get transplanted out. The soils are drying out for us so we'll be able to get in there and work them and get them out. So we have a big week ahead of us and a big season ahead of us. And, uh, we are really grateful to all the people who support local agriculture and who go out of their way um, to find products that uh, that meet their family's needs. We don't we don't use any uh, pesticides, uh, synthetic pesticides or uh, fertilizers. We use compost only uh, to feed our our foods and uh, and build our soils and and people really like that. They like to have something that uh, that they know is safe for their family to eat and and that was harvested most likely a day before they bought it. Uh, so uh, your lettuce tends to last about 10 or 10 days or two weeks uh, when you buy it from us, whereas sometimes in the grocery you turn around and it's gone. Um, anyhow, uh, yeah, we we try to grow everything and and we, we love it. It's uh, really hard work, um, but uh, I, think, I think that's what they say. It's, when you love doing what you're doing, it doesn't matter how hard it is because that's what you'd be doing anyway. So, uh, We look forward to seeing you at one of the tailgate markets, and uh, they start up in the middle of April. So.